Hello, everybody. I'm the Gold One. Welcome back to Trails in the Sky. Well, I think we're about to start day three of the tournament. Don't know why I couldn't think of the word for tournament, but I found the word. It's okay, guys. I got it. I got the word. Let's make our way to the Oh, that guy's zooming past. He is fucking fat. Damn. Uh, we could go train, but I don't want to. That's time consuming. I don't really feel like it. So, we will go through here and die. Probably lose. Probably lose. Welcome, everyone, to the Grand Arena! Please note the tournament participants are asked to remain within the arena's walls until the end of the day's matches. Have you made all the necessary preparations for a day of hot, hot action? Bring it on, motherfucker. I just bit my lip. That hurt. Your waiting room is in the blue team room, just inside the hall on the right side. Fight well. We will fight well, my friend. We will. Looks like it's just us in here. The waiting room feels awfully big right now. Well, it's it actually is a pretty big room. Team sports events and circuses alike used to be out here. Wait. What sports were held in this world? Do they have football? Do they have, like... Soccer, but with... Orbment usage or something? I don't know. But that was back when the time when Glide- Oh god, you're like a fat monster was a man's only source of entertainment. Interesting. I guess that would explain the size if there were circus animals in here. I must say, it certainly doesn't measure up to the Imperial Opera House. But even so, it's about the size of an outdoor concert venue. And that's certainly acceptable. A key that's for being less gaudy than you imperialists. That sounds offensive. I think we may have gotten a little too early though. We've still got a sizable chunk of time before the match starts. Really? Uh, waiting around for your match start to start really does get kind of boring. So why don't we go walk around the grounds for a little while then? Works for me? Sure, just make sure you're here in time for the match. Match. Bye. Well, well, what a new turn of events this is. I thought for sure you'd go with them. Hmm, I just get the feeling that something's changed between the two of them. Some type of step forward. Hello, Mr. Observant. They've definitely been feeling some pressure from the main matches. But today they seem to be a lot more relaxed. Oh, to be young again. That's young again. But... Are they ready for the feelings that well from within them? Even if they are not, the feelings are surely ready for them. Haha, <laughs> such delightful awkwardness. I look forward to what is to come. I really just don't get you. <sighs> Something wrong? Are you feeling alright? I'm okay, I just got the chills all of a sudden. Like someone's talking about us or plotting something. I think I guess, I think I can guess who that is. Alright, where are we walking to? Cat, I don't need you on my lap while I'm doing this. You smell funny. Could go to the opposite side, is that where we gotta go? Isn't this the wrong room? I'm pretty sure that there are rooms on. Oh, well, we're walking on the ground, I was wondering if there any one. If we needed to go talk to the enemy team. Hello! Just do what you're gonna do and do it well, and good things will come of it. I'm sure. I'm freaking sure. Alright, where do we go? What? What are we walking around for? Where are you walking to? There's gotta be someone we gotta talk to. Or else they wouldn't have us do this. Oh. Hey. We're all here for you. You're representing the Bracer Guild. So be sure to make us proud. Hey, newbies. Your opponents are tough, but you guys should be able to take them. No sweat. Break a leg up there. We'll be cheering for you like you wouldn't believe. Got something wrong, Kurt? Hmm, oh, it's you guys. Guess it's time for the final match. Just give it all you've got, okay? You bet. You don't look so good, Kurt. Are you okay? You do seem pale. Nah, it's just a little lightheaded, that's all. Though it's kind of odd, I don't feel sick, so why am I lightheaded? I think I'm having a flashback? Ow. I wasn't aware 
I was gonna wear flashback to give people headache. Flashbacks? From what? Yesterday? No, no, no. From an accident I had about three months ago. Seems I screwed on a job and messed myself up pretty bad. What do you mean, seems? You don't mean amnesia, do you? I do. It's kind of embarrassing and perhaps even a bit cliched. But I actually don't remember a thing about it. Or didn't, anyway. I still can't remember what job I was doing that got me hurt in the first place. The doctor said it wasn't shock or anything, but offered no explanation as to what it could be. Wow, what a story. But you were still okay to participate in the match, even in that condition? I told you, physically, there isn't a thing wrong with me. In fact, I'm feeling a lot better just talking it over. And, and in time, these flashbacks will start to take shape, and I'll remember what happened, so don't worry about me. Aw, uh, that's pretty suspicious. Pretty sus. You're starting to do a little better than you did a minute. You're starting to look a little better than you did a minute ago. Just be careful, though, okay? Thanks. You guys, too. Good luck out there. Alright, my friend. Hey, Estelle! You did it, The final fight! It's so exciting! Deep breaths, Dorothy. Come on now. Do it with me. If you don't relax, keep yourself still and focused. You won't be able to get any good shots. Oh, don't you worry about that. I take my best shots when I'm all hyped up like this. They're more natural, you see. Oh, uh, oh, I guess they would be? Dorothy, I think you're some kind of savant or something. Who else can I talk to? Hello, rich people. Alright, let's go to the other side. The other side. The other side. The other side of me. The other side. The other side. The other side of the tournament. Oh, it's the same thing. Oh, it's just flipped. Okay, never mind. Uh, back to my room? I guess back to my room. That was a boring adventure. Yo, we're back. Uh, where else to go? Do I need to go outside? Uh, what the fuck? What happened? This time has finally come. Break a leg, guys. Sin team, you're in the blue team room. Uh, yeah. Who else do I need to talk to? It's gotta be someone in this. In this. Oh. Found who I need to talk to. It's my best friend, Professor Abba. Let's tell Joshua. Professor? You can't watch us? Ah, oh, but of course. You've always been such a big help to me. I owe you two at least that much. Thanks, Professor. But how'd you scrap together the mirror for a ticket? Well, that was a bit of a lucky part break on my part, actually. The museum director has some sudden business to end to, so he couldn't make it today. And I am here in his stead. Ha! <laughs> Should have guessed you'd never be able to get in there here on your own pockets. Ha! <laughs> Not that I wouldn't try, of course. I'm sure I would, could find a way if I put my mind to it. At any rate, I am here and here I am. And I'll be shouting your names for sure. Knock them dead, you two. You bet we will. Thank you, Professor. I think it's the last person I know. Yeah, I think it's everybody right now. Unless I know any of these random people. Uh, yeah, that should be. Oh, wait. Nope, I thought, was, I thought this was just Teresa and the kids. Dick. Sure, why do the kids have names, but these spectators don't? Ah. Uh. Okay, I guess we'll just. I think we're done. I think that's everybody we need to talk to. I didn't talk to Mr. Alba. Yeah, there we go. Oh! Estelle, Joshua, is that you? Who is this? Mayor Klaus? What brings you here? It's good to see you both again. Sherazar told me that you'd be gone. You've gone traveling all over the kingdom. You've certainly grown up nicely in the time since we've last met. <laughs> Thank you very much. Well, I can't really speak for myself, really, but you can certainly, but you certainly seem chipper as ever, Mr. Mayor. It's kind of refreshing to see. Haha, <laughs> well, I won't let you young folk beat me t just yet. So I hear that you two made it all the way to the championship in this big martial arts competition. I may be a little old for watch for such things, but I came to watch. You came all the way from Roland for that? No, no. Actually, I got an invitation out of the blue to a, din to a diner at Pi- Diner party at Grantel Castle. I only arrived in Grantel this morning and came by way of the airliner. No way! 
Ah, I think I get it. The invitation came from Duke D Dunan, right? Oh, you know of it? I was originally planning to attend a birth ceremony for this marriage married couple, and then the journey here. But this lady officer approached me out of nowhere, told me that I was invited to this dinner party. Well, I'm guessing who that is. Yeah, I had to be Captain Amathea. Sorry, it's not in my life, it's just not much of the traveling sort. So I didn't have much choice but to come here by myself. Aw, uh, she's not here? Pardon me, Mayor. Is there a chance I may also be there's a chance we may also be attending that dinner party. Oh. Dr. Sure explained that Duke had stated that the winner of the competition would be would be receiving a formal invitation to the party. That's not what it says, that's what I'm saying. Ah, I see. Well, that explains it. Apparently it seems appropriate to call for a dining dinner party when Her Majesty has taken ill. But if you two will be there, I might not feel so awkward. Just so that just just oh, so that just means that you'll have to try to win that much harder. <laughs> you bet. We'll try our best to meet your expectations. I think I'm going to find myself a seat then. Best of luck to the both of you. Goodbye, sir. I can't believe he's I can't believe he's going to be at that dinner party too. I think Mayor Maybell will be there as well. Seems likely. There will probably be a lot of influential people in attendance. Hmm. Ah well. We just need to focus on winning our match, and then we'll see everyone there. Sounds good. Speaking of which, it's almost time. Let's return to the waiting room. Okay. So they're gathering up all the mayors and stuff. They're gonna threaten them into, uh, like, teaming up or obeying them. That seems like the most likely outcome. Ooh, purple. Ooh. Oh, there's the asshole. Oh, looks like the Duke and Colonel Richard are showing up together today. Indeed. Maybe he's here to watch his subordinate compete. Oh, so that's the Royal Army's darling of the public, eh? He's handsome enough and well-groomed. He looks like he's the capable sort. Yeah, I, I guess so. Hmm, he doesn't seem to bear much resemblance to when I saw him in both. In terms of, at least in terms of character. <laughs> but what indeed can one do? I suppose that he is worthy of the, being considered a rival of the great Olivier Lineham. Now he's worried about that. Looks like he's starting. I must apologize to everyone for the long wait. Now, we now open the final day of the martial arts competition's full contact matches. The arena has been a buzz with preparation and fighting for the better part of the week now. And it all accumulates right here, right now. Which team will see the ultimate victory this day? Without further ado, I present the fight card for this, the championship match. Southside blue team from the Calvary Republic, Captain is Zin. Northside red team from the Royal Bitch Ass and Television Division, Special Forces, Captain Second Lieutenant Fuckface. Uh, I trust everyone is ready to put everything into this. For cheers or for laughter, that is. Game faces, guys. Yeah, let's kick these assholes. Let's kick. Let's just fist these assholes. Just. All the way in. Balls deep. Everyone we fought so far has been as tough as tapioca. That half this team is a pair of rookies? Thought they'd be able to stand up to us. <laughs> Don't be so sure. But they're a part of the Bracer Guild. Indeed. We've been reading up on them. Good. Now stay focused. I don't underestimate them. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, what are these guys grousing about over there? Just let them be, Estelle. If they're all, if they're covering the faces like that, I can't imagine, can't imagine they have much in the way of self-confidence. Fuck Olivier, there was no need for that murder. Since they lack my dazzling good looks, there's probably a lot of sniping and backbiting in their ranks. What the hell is that supposed to mean? I'll have you know I'm considered very attractive to the point of Um, second lieutenant Lawrence, right? What is it, boy? Joshua? The sword, sword, that sword technique. No, never mind. Best of luck. Ha, <laughs> and to you. Hey, don't let their talk get you all depressed. We're about to start. We now begin the final match of the martial arts competition. Both teams go to your starting places. ADS be with you. Ready? Begin! Ah, oh, shit, they're moving first. Okay, Joshua. You got this, bro. Oh, man, this is some kick ass battle music. Let's start this shit with a flicker. You guys aren't going anywhere. Oh man, this is oh this is this is the good shit. All right, just intend, my brother. Just intend, my brother. 
Get all hyped! Ah, shit. No, not Joshua. Or Estelle. Alright, Estelle. You gotta use some art since you don't have any, uh... You have no CP right now. Uh, Alright. Do some blue impact on the... Uh, get this guy. And, uh, you too. Oh, man. Look at all the healing packs. Um... Oh, ooh, oh yeah, Hell's Gate. Yeah. Get the shit done. Oh, they're gonna attack us a lot. No, not. Ah, Estelle again. You got a problem with Estelle? Earth guy. Well, it's fine. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not coming after you right now. I'm gonna, I'm gonna rid of your uh, support in first. Boom. Oh, you did nothing to him. Oh, no, Olivier. No, Olivier. No. I wish. I so wish there was a counter function in this game. Oh, they had insta-kill? That's BS. I hate that crap. Alright, um... Yeah, Joshua. Oh, fuck you. You fucking whore. Get your shit out of here, bitch. Uh, I need to heal you. I hate that they can just zoom halfway across the fucking ring. Oh, fuck you. Dude, you fucking whore. Get the fuck out of here. I don't fucking want a power level. This game's combat is not that enjoyable. Yo, fuck this bullshit. Well, they just fucking immune to fucking. They just goddamn immune to. I hate that they can zoom across the map. It's so dumb. There should be a serious limit on that crap. Uh, composure, just ten, just ten. Alright, let's try this again. Alright, it's Estelle. Uh, it's blue impact. No, God. Why would you let me? What was? What are you thinking, game? Why was that? Why would it start on Joshua? How does that make any sense? 
Hey, you know, Joshua is fully healed. Yeah, we're gonna have to start on him. Like, why? It's not helped that I did not start with full CB. That's not cool game. Okay, um... I hate that they're mean the instant. Oh, no, 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 Why is this defense so. How is this a winless? He does like 500 damage. It's one down. Oh no, you game. Instant death is so stupid. First point. I don't want to power level game. I have no desire to go run around killing monsters for hours in a game since combat is not great. This combat shit. I'm not playing this game for its combat. Uh, Well, I gotta call this video here because I got a fucking power level. And I am back. And this time, I am level 30 now. So hopefully we can now, you know, beat the assholes. If not, well, I'll cut the end of the video with that. And uh, power level, more. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Lord skills, yep. You're getting this, yep. Gotcha, ready, begin! <laughs> Alright. Let's get this shit started with some distance. Alright. Bye, everybody. Alright, Joshua, you need to cloak and dagger. No, you need to, uh, evil eye. What the fuck? This is new. Okay. Oh shit! Ah, don't come after. Don't come after Olivier. He's just trying to mind his own business. All right. Resist. Ah, no, no, Olivier. Ah, no, no, Olivier again. Ah, oh, no, Joshua. You whores. Smite their bitch asses. Boom. That's fine, I'm not fighting you right now. That's fine, she can use arts. Uh, no, fuck you. Fuck you, stop talking how to sell you whores. There we go. All right, still. Oh, fuck you. Just he missed all of them but one. Come on.
Fuck, I wanna use this. I hate that you can't set which one you wanna use. Really? There's one down. Oh, fuck you. I hate that he gives a, he one thing cast spells, there's no delay. Oh, come on. See, there's absolutely no delay, so there's no way of fucking interrupting it. See whether that's bullshit. There should be some kind of delay on his attacks. See, look at how much delay is on, on Olivier. Look at that, look at that insane delay. Why do you keep missing? Jesus, game. Can't fucking kill these assholes because they keep getting killed. I bet he's immune to that shit, though. But No! Fuck you. Don't miss! Oh, thank god. Yeah, he has two Aura Blasts, which I was trying to use. But it just needs delay. There we go, two down. Two down! Ten to go now, because he, he fucking created copies of himself. Come on, still kill him! Don't miss! Oh, Stell, you're so- oh. Earth Guard. Come on! You gotta have some kind of delay on this, or it's just. It's cheap. Guard? What the f. Okay, uh, where we got. There we go, Andrew Hill. Okay, it's just you, you asshole. It's time to die. Oh, wait, he guarded because he was using a stupid bullshit. Okay, gotcha. No, no, he's good. Oh, fuck you, asshole. Seriously? Seriously? Fuck you. Oh, his delay has no fucking anything. Look at this. It's like some bullshit ass delays on my stuff. Alright, use your, uh,. Ass craft. Estelle. Yeah, beat his ass with your staff. Show him that ultra violence you're always talking about. Oh, damn. Nah, fuck that shit. Fuck you, you don't get to heal yourself, you bitch. Yeah, show him the rest of the Olivier. Pew 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 pew! Ah, he's gonna kill himself. Earth guard. What the f? That's bullshit! Wow. Ooh, just. Just wow game. You really just let him heal himself for 2,000 and before I can even do anything. 
He may only heal himself enough. It's not fun. Ha, bitch. So what you got? A blue one? What you got? For me, Estelle, what's your strongest attack? I'm pretty sure he also has that fish frame blast. Uh, okay, I should do that. Uh, you. Oh, fuck you. Uh, what's, what do you have? Movement increase, confused, slash probably useless, aerial. I wish I had some more. Clock up? Uh, okay. He's running, he's running at low on arts. Oh, thank God. Yeah, no. Oh, oh, cancel, cancel, cancel. Oh, where is it? I thought you had a. Do you not have a delay? Oh, there he does. Cool. He just AC delayed him. Uh, on you. Impede. Aha. You bitch. None of that shit. Oh, thank God. For that, um, Earth Guard. How much longer does your buff last? I'll watch him with this. Finish him, Zed. Yes! Fuck you! Oh, yeah, we did. 175 experience, that's it? I was getting more experience than those stupid rats in the sewer. Oh, that's a lot of stuff, but though. Guys. It can't be. We're the best of the best that Special Ops have to offer. How could we lose? Because you didn't drink enough milk and you didn't eat your vitamins. Something like that. Bah! We're beaten. Yahoo! We won. We really won? <sighs> I'm exhausted. Now the winning team will be blessed with a few words from Duke Dunan. It's this asshole. Representing the team will be Zin Valthic. Oh, that's his last name? I didn't know his last name. Please come forward. Yes, sir. Whoa, here. I'm gonna give him a bigger up close. Are you all these spinners as huge as this? No, I'm a little out. I'm a little outside the ordinary. I just ate well, slept well, and trained diligently ever since I was very young. I'm the way I am because I tend to think about everything very carefully and clearly. <laughs> oh, I see. I like you, Zen. Allow me to present you with the prize of 100,000 Mira and 100,000 Mira. Wait, is that going to us too, or just him? Thank you very much, sir. <gasps> I did get the hatch of Mira! Yay! Money! Hey, you shine our light and glory upon you and your friends. My beloved citizens, let's hear a big round of applause for the victors. Ha! <laughs> what an interesting conclusion, I'd say. <laughs> Lieutenant Lawrence, you truly have no shame. His Excellency must surely be ashamed to see his men beaten by such rabble. We all... We, was that all posturing just for show? I am indeed... Shamed. <laughs> Come now, Mothia, you didn't even criticize him, so. Truth told, I, I myself asked Lawrence what Fuck you. Fuck you. I would. It would behoove any member. What the fuck are you doing? Get the fuck out of here. It would behoove any member of the Intelligence Division not to put all of this strength on display. 
In, in, in this instance, it works in, to our benefit that the others win the championship. I see. This grace too seems taken with the Easterner. She'll serve as an ample distraction. Still, it is a pity. If Lieutenant Schwarz or General Morgan had participated, the show would have been far more dynamic. <laughs> Surely you jest, sir. If you truly wanted the tournament to be more dynamic, perhaps you should have participated yourself. The likes of Julia are no match for your strength, after all. <laughs> I don't think quite that highly of my skill with the sword. I Hardly, sir. I believe you somewhat overestimate my strength. I'm nothing but an unrefined former Jaeger in a soldier's uniform. I beg to differ. I have confidence in my ability to judge the strength of others. And about the other person I could see being able to fight you on the turn to be him. And about the only person... Is Speaking of whom... His children will shortly be entering Grantle. Oh, he's talking about Cassius. I thought so. Shouldn't be taking some sort of step to deal with them? Leave them be. We'll honor the arrangement with the Duke. And besides, it's far too late for a bracer guild to cause any, us any real trouble. Arrogant bastard. Florence, how far along would you gauge the plan's progress? Just over 90%, sir. I'm certain I'll be able to guide you to our destination within the next few days. Excellent. Who's this fuck? A few damn... Uh, a new dawn fast approaches for this kingdom, and even if I must endure the stigma of treason, I shall pave the way for the glorious morrow. Oh, when those guys are the messiah complex, ugh, they're the worst. Only I can save the world, cause I am so fucking cool. Fuck everybody else. Phew, now that was one hell of a fight. I had no idea that Lieutenant Lawrence was so freaking strong. Yes, I think we got lucky. Even now, it's hard to believe. I don't like it. Huh? Eh, it's nothing. More importantly, that fancy shindig is supposed to be happening tonight. From what I understand, it's going to be run late into the night, so they're setting up the rooms for us. Ah, most generous of them. Rubbing shoulders with all these stuffed shirts is sure to chafe in the worst way. In, worst way, in uncomfortable places. But dining, laboral royal dining, laboral royal dining, the very prospect of such decadence. Looks to me, my mouth can barely contain itself. Where is my handkerchief? Hand. Handkerchief. Uh, it's getting in your- Ew, gross. Ah, gross. It's good to see that you haven't passed your sense of perspective, Olivier. <laughs> Indeed, let us be off then. Off to gorge our souls upon the seven courses of courtly affection. Oh, that's the plan, is it? Oh. Well, well, fancy meeting you here. Oh. It's Fander, you son of a bitch. You wander all over the place every damn day and leave me wondering what the hell you're up to. Have you gone completely mad? What past? What possessed you to participate in the martial arts competition? Oh, come now, my dear Mueller. There's no need to crease your lovely face with such an ill-tempered expression. After all, it is not true that good fortune. It's not true that good fortune comes to those who favor those around them with a smile. Oh, true good fortune comes to those who favor those around them with a smile. I am smiling! Is it just me, or do you recognize that uniform? Yeah, it looks like the Imperial military to me. Hmm, he looks like he could be a tough one to take out in a fight, too. How strong is Mueller? I, I don't think you ever fight him, and you never have him on the team. As far as I, well, not in Cold Steel, at least. I don't believe we've met. My name is Mueller. I was recently appointed to resident military officer at the Erbronium Air Embassy. I've done this whack job for a very long time. Oh, one might call us schoolyard chums. <laughs> Fret not over his dark demeanor. Without it, his presence wouldn't light up the room the way it does. Okay, you really need to shut up now. Right. Uh -huh. Now where was I? From the looks of things, this fellow has caused you some trouble. Uh, as a representative of the Arabonian Embassy, I sincerely apologize. Oh, it's okay. He hasn't really been a bother. Actually, he was a big help to us in the tournament. Uh, Olivier? Did you deliberately try to keep your participation in the tournament a secret from the Embassy? <laughs> oh, perish the thought. No, no, rather, I simply never told them. How is that any different from hiding it? But, okay, fine. What's done is done. Now, though, we're, you're going, you're, we're going back to the embassy. Yes, you're coming with me. Uh, please, don't wait a moment. We have all been invited to a delightful, indeed wondrous diner party. Delightful and wondrous, eh? Sentais, too bad you won't be attending. You're going to be confined to the embassy for a little while. Are, are you serious? When do I ever joke? Oh, cruel fate. Truly you drive a knife into my very heart. The promise of this dinner party has been all that's helped me maintain my will to live. You know, I actually feel kind of bad for him. 
Is it really that big of a deal if you let him go to the party? What's your reasoning behind this? I knew I could count on you. Ah, but how lovely, ah, uh, but how lovely a thing is a true friendship. Such warmth and affection as opposed to the cruel frigidity of my schoolyard chum. I don't think you folks really understand how serious this is. But try to picture this. A dinner party probably by royalty and its influential guests from across the country. And also in attendance an arrogant fool who never shuts his mouth because his foot is lodged so far into it. And if they found out that this uncouth imbecile was an Erebonian citizen. Uh, oh no, guys. <laughs> guys. Oh, you guys. Guys, rude. My beautiful, gracious companions. Why have you suddenly fallen so silent? I'm sorry, Olivier, but he does kind of have a point. Yeah, your usual behavior might not be appreciated in the royal castle. Hmm. True, we wouldn't want to start an international incident, would we? I mean, he's the prince. So easily? The war ended only 10 years ago. Relationship between our countries can still be strained at times. You'll just have to grin and bear it, Olivier. Please, Mueller, hear me out. I'm sorry I didn't say anything before, you know, when you... This isn't a debate. My dinner party! My royal cuisine! Uh, is this really okay? I can't say I really like it, but the facts are the facts. Well, there's nothing much we can do about it now. We'll just have to enjoy ourselves twice as much in order to make up for him not being able to join us. Oh, oh well, I guess you're right. Let's get our stuff together and go to Grantham Castle then. Grand next episode, which I'm pretty sure will be the almost the end of the game. I think we're pretty close. So if you like this video, give a like, comment, subscribe, and thanks for watching. Golden one out.